Hi, I'm Steve Cohen, president of Mystic Aquarium, which is actually part of Sea Research Foundation. We work in research, education, and exploration. And in addition to Mystic Aquarium, we have the Institute for Exploration, which is home to Dr. Robert Ballard in partnership with the University of Rhode Island, and the Jason Project, which is an international distance learning program working all over the world, science education, and particularly with a marine science education. Sorry I can't be here with you today to uh, welcome you in person, and that's largely because of our global work in education. I'm in Singapore, I hope, by the time you're seeing this, and I'm talking to folks in Singapore about our education programs and hopefully bringing the, the good news and the good message of Mystic Aquarium and Sea Research Foundation in New England and Rhode Island and Connecticut to the people of Singapore. How's that? I want to welcome all of you to uh, this great place and I want to thank especially Kurt Harrington who has asked me to do this and speak with you and who certainly is your host this evening. As you look around the aquarium you'll see the work of something fishy. very proud and very pleased to partner with Something Fishy uh, on the fish and invertebrate programs here at Mystic Aquarium. They've done a remarkable job helping us to uh, redesign our exhibits and to freshen up our tanks and to work with our staff uh, to provide leadership and leadership training to our uh, wonderful uh, husbandry staff in the fish and invertebrate area. So we're very proud of Kurt and Don Harrington and Something Fishy and we're really pleased to be a big part of the Rhode Island economy. Many of you as CEOs of uh, companies in Rhode Island uh, know how difficult these times are and how important it is that we generate jobs and economic uh, development for the state and for this entire region. We take that very seriously here at Mystic Aquarium. Many of our employees, large number of our employees, are Rhode Island residents and of course a large number of our customers are Rhode Island residents. We work very closely with schools throughout the state of Rhode Island and with Boys and Girls Clubs and other after school programs uh, throughout the state to provide solid educational programming particularly in the sciences and in marine science in particular of course uh, to those uh, schools and after school programs. So we're a big part of Rhode Island and we're just thrilled and delighted to welcome you here Tonight, I hope you have a chance to walk around and see the great exhibits. In addition to the fish and invertebrate area, which uh, Don and Kurt Harrington work in, we are one of the world's largest, uh, we have one of the world's largest collections of marine mammals. Uh, we're known for our beluga whales, for our stellar sea lions, both of which are endangered uh, species, and for our African penguin collection as well.
So a big part of what we do, of course, is to spread the word about the importance of the oceans, the importance of conserving the oceans. We hope that you'll have a chance to walk around, see our collection, see our exhibits, and enjoy yourself. And thank you very, very much, not only for being here, but for everything you do uh, to support Rhode Island and to support southern New England. Thank you. Have a great time. <laughs>